Welcome to day three of Japanese Classic Car Show's World Matsuri Week. We're keeping things going today with more great cars from the 1970s. So let's not waste another minute. Let's jump in. First up, here's Jose Gonzalez's 1972 Nissan Skyline, coming to us from Clinton Township, Michigan. This creatively modified Hakoska is powered by an L28 bored out to 3 liters. There can't be too many early Skylines in the state of Michigan, but Jose's car represents the mark to a T. Jose Gonzalez from Detroit, my 1972 Nissan Skyline, better known as Hakoska. Do a quick rock around.
Next, from Torrance, California, Brett Stebel brings us this race-prepared 1974 Mazda RX-3. Evoking the famous 1970s touring car racer of Yoshimi Katayama, Brett's RX-3 boasts a three-rotor 20B pumping out 400 horsepower. From Okazaka City, Japan, here's the 1974 Datsun 260Z of Takayuki Suzuki. This Shakotan Z has been creatively modified with a G nose as well as an L28 stroker motor. Katsuo Maehara sends his 1974 Mazda rotary pickup to us from Saitama, Japan. Mazda fans will know that the Ripu was never sold new in Japan. Katsuo imported this USDM specimen into Japan himself and is showing it at JCCS for the second time this year. Carl Nelson's 1973 Datsun 620 pickup comes to us from Henderson, Nevada. Carl describes his creatively modified 620 as a low-budget home build, which goes to show what you can accomplish with a little talent and creativity. Hi, I'm Carl Nelson, and this is my 1973 Datsun 620 bullet size. From Kingman, Arizona, here's Benjamin Davis's 1976 Toyota Hilux, complete with matching trailer. This resto mod pickup is powered by a 22RE from an 84 Celica and is being shown at JCCS for the first time this year. Jeff Yee's 1976 Toyota Celica is a frequent visitor to JCCS, having been shown here on seven previous occasions. This period-style Celica has had its 18RG bored out to 2.2 liters displacement. This nut-and-bolt restored 1973 Toyota Celica TA22 comes to us from Nico Yonganil of Hauda, the Netherlands. Nico has owned this extensively restored Celica for over two decades and is showing at JCCS for the first time in 2020. Next up is Robert Brownlee's 1978 Datsun 280Z. This creatively modified Tritone S30 makes its home in San Diego, California, and has been shown at JCCS on numerous occasions. Tak Goto of Tayo Sales in Torrance, California presents this 1972 Datsun 240Z. This creatively modified S30 has been in Tak's possession for nearly 20 years. Keith Yakushi has owned this 1972 Datsun 510 since 1975. The car served both as his daily driver and autocross weapon and now resides in Foster City, California as a period style tribute to the famous BRE Brockbuster 510. This wide body Star Road 1973 Datsun 240Z comes to us from Masashi Takahashi of Torrance, California. Under the hood of this creatively modified Z beats an L28 heart. It's being shown at JCCS for the first time this year. We'll be back with more cars of the 1970s after this message from Star Road. We'd like to thank Star Road for their continuing support of JCCS. Star Road is an icon for tuning and restoration of vintage Japanese cars in Japan, specializing in Nissan Skyline, Hakoska, and Kenmeri, as well as Fairlady Zs. 
You might have met Mr. Inoue, the CEO of Star Road, at the company's booth at JCCS in 2018 or 2019. Star Road's popular original body kits can be ordered here in the USA through JDMCarParts.com. Here's the iconic wide-body orange Star Road Fighter Z, captured by Japanese Kyushu magazine Nostalgic Speed.基本的にうちのコンセプトはもうストリートが一番のメインで、スポーツ走行も楽しめるようにはしてますけど、基本はもう快適に楽しく走れるようなシオで作ってます。エンジンは3200ccですね。ソレックスの50倍。まあボディの
let's get back to the cars of the 1970s here on day three of World Matsuri Week 2020, presented by Japanese Classic Car Show. From Los Angeles, California, here's Tede Yonenaka's 1973 Datsun 240Z. This persimmon red period style S30 is an original numbers matching car and is being shown at JCCS for the second time this year. Masumi Nakano sends us this 1972 Nissan Skyline from Okazaki, Japan. We're glad that JCCS's online format for 2020 has given Masumi the opportunity to share this iconic Hakoska Skyline with the world. Kelvin Chung's Resto Mod 1972 Mazda RX2 is a familiar sight at Japanese Classic Car Show, having made five previous appearances. Based in Daly City, California, this significant car in Mazda history has been updated with a Bridgeport 13B engine. Evoking true 70s style, here's Bob Vargas Jr.'s 1978 Mazda RX3 SP from Pleasant Hill, California. This period style RX3 has been with Bob for over 20 years and is a frequent guest at JCCS. Isaac Chu's Resto Mod 1976 Mazda 808 comes to us from El Paso, Texas, and is a great ambassador for Kyusha style in the 915. There's no heartbreak with this 808, which has received an intriguing RX3 nose conversion. We're not finished with the rotaries just yet. Here's Victor Chico's rotary-powered 1971 Datsun 510 out of Los Angeles, California. This 510 is equipped with a turbocharged 13B, as well as a 5-speed transmission out of an FC RX-7 turbo. Carlos Olveri of Rancho Palos Verdes, California, sticks to Nissan power for his 1971 Datsun 510, but this car is by no means stock. This Resto Mod 510 features an SR20 DET power plant. From Folsom, California, here's James Higgs' creatively modified 1973 Datsun 620 pickup. Nearly every component on this Go Mango Orange 620 has been customized or upgraded. James is showing his pickup at JCCS for the first time this year. Making its second appearance at JCCS is the Resto Mod 1975 Datsun 620 of Maricopa, Arizona's Brian Moore. This attention-getting 620 features a blacktop SR20 DET swap. Juan Quinones of Miami, Florida brings us his creatively modified 1979 Toyota Celica. Appearing at JCCS for the first time this year, Juan Celica boasts a turbocharged 22R engine with twin Weber carbs and an HKS wastegate. This stock original 1979 Toyota Celica comes to us from James Anderson of McGrady, North Carolina. Incredibly, this Celica only has 6,500 miles from new, making it probably one of the lowest mileage A40 generation Celicas in America. Gilles Girouard of Montreal, Quebec brings this 1977 Toyota Celica. Gilles is the original owner of this RA29 Celica, which he is showing at JCCS for the first time this year. Merci, Gilles! Escondido, California's Oliver Ferrer presents his 1973 Toyota Carina. A refreshingly original platform for a resto mod build, Oliver's car is powered by a 2JZ GTE engine out of a Toyota Aristo.
Finally, we have the 1975 Nissan Fairlady Z Resto mod, courtesy of Nobukazu Katoka of Okayama, Japan. Being shown at JCCS for the first time this year, this Fairlady Z features a TC24B1 engine by OS Giken. And now it's time for Kyusha Trivia, brought to you by Japanese Nostalgic Car. Japanese Nostalgic Car is the premier English language site for classic Japanese cars, and each day during World Matsuri Week, they'll be bringing you a trivia question to test your Kyusha knowledge. If you answer correctly, you'll be entered into a daily drawing for a sticker set from JNC and JCCS. To submit your answer, go to JapaneseNostalgicCar.com and click the JCCS 2020 link. And now, here's today's Kyusha Trivia Question. Today's Trivia Question is sponsored by Nissan. At the unveiling of the Nissan Z Proto, Nissan CEO Makoto Uchida talked about his first car. What kind of car was it? Go to JapaneseNostalgicCar.com to submit your answer. Good luck! That's it for day three of World Matsuri Week. Join us tomorrow as we shift our focus to the rad rides of the 1980s. I'm Patrick Strong. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you tomorrow.